hello friends in the last lecture we have seen how to automate a sample web page using selenium so let's run that code okay so um, here we are just entering user id password and clicking on sign in button and verifying the coming text like it is currently coming captcha validation needed which is not matching against our expectation expected message so it is failing okay that's the thing so uh, in the same way today we'll try to automate this tableau dashboard uh, like we are automating this web page okay so i am making a copy of that because it is in the same way we'll automate so let's rename it automation 02 tab to dashboard automation in the tablet dashboard automation uh, here we need to point to our URL this tablet URL okay so this user ID password field we don't need yes we need the button here suppose we want to click on this button so that it will change its state okay to identify or locate this element by selenium let's use uh, locators uh, sorry let me open it in div separately here i have opened it so to identify like inspect it this element it is currently in this state let's reload this page let's try to identify this element this is the parent tag for that element id okay let's see whether it is locating it or not add the rate id equal to this value see it is the unique locator for it let's try to put it in our code this is the locator uh, let's name it button toggle okay then we will be clicking on this toggle message toggle button and all these we don't need let's run it it has opened that particular page web page or tableau dashboard and it is trying to click uh, once the page is loaded it is trying to identify or locate that element and then it will click on that but it will not happen because it is a tableau dashboard and it is not not like normally normal html dom page where you will able to identify the element because all the elements are made on canvas and uh, it's like image and inside the tableau dashboard the selenium has no access so it will unable to identify that element and will throw no such element found exception let's see see here the message no such element exception because it will not able to identify though still the element is present sometimes also this id changes that is another problem but here if same thing we will try to identify here through the xpath we can see the element is present but selenium unable to understand that okay to identify <coughs> to address this issue we will try in a different way to automate the tableau dashboard using selenium uh, let's try to identify or fetch text from another element apart from this element let's try to locate this element overview okay it is the text xpath would be at the rate text 
equal to overview no not it is not attribute it is direct text see overview is highlighted see overview is getting highlighted over here but let's see whether it is able to identify it or not whether it is able to locate it or not comment this code driver dot find elements by dot x path what is the value of x path this overview from this web element we will try to find the get the text get text and we will store in a string actual text equal to this and we will try to print this okay let's run it once again close this existing page and this time also it will throw the element not found exception because in the way which we are normally automate the web page in the same way tableau is like uh, not we will not able to automate tableau tableau is can't be automated so we will use tableau javascript api to automate that so in the upcoming lecture we will see that how to automate the tableau dashboard using tableau javascript api see again no such element found exception for this xpath okay even if you try to locate it you can locate it successfully you will be able to locate it successfully but selenium is unable to identify this it is the problem with tableau and selenium at current scenario so you can't directly automate this we will explore its solution in next lecture thank you thanks for watching this session